guess a really quick intro here for this issue that I was having with my 14700K 14th gen Intel CPU. I was getting between 95 degrees Celsius and 100 degrees Celsius and I could not really fix this until I figured out you can you can alter the wattage you're getting. So what you're going to want to do here is just download this. I'll put this in the description. It's called Intel Extreme Tuning Utility. This is specifically if you have an Intel CPU. So uh, you can also do this in your in your BIOS if you don't have an Intel CPU, but this is actually done th through the desktop. So what you're going to do is you're going to open your open this app and then you're going to click on advanced tuning. So I think b before it looked like this and you're going to click advanced view. You're going to click on advanced tuning and then you're going to go to these two right here. So this is Turbo Boost Short Power Max. And this is basically what you're gonna allow your CPU to get in terms of power in the short term. So this is also known as PL2 or Power Limit 2. If you're trying to go through the BIOS and do this, this was like 300 before, which is insane. So this should be lowered um, through some research. I found 180 is a good number. And then this is for, you can, see the def you can see the defaults here. This is unlimited and this is 253 as a default. This is Power Limit 1, which is uh, long so this is max over a long period of time so I learned this is a little bit lower so for this one turbo boost short power max you're gonna lower it to 180 and this one you're lower to 150 all this is doing is reducing the amount of power you're going your CPU is going to get in different points in time which is going to keep your your CPU's temperature lower so mine went from around 95 to 100 down to around 80 85 which is perfectly fine for these CPUs um, I'm going to explain something else in the next half of this video is we're going to come into the Battlefield 6 game We're going to click on settings. We're going to go to graphics Then we're going to click graphics quality settings now if you're having a lot of issues You have a different CPU you might lower this down as much as you can you might have already done this But what you're gonna do is make this custom and then come into the graphics quality settings a really nice feature of this game is whenever you hover over a certain setting if it has a certain impact on the CPU or the GPU so if you're getting really high temperature on your CPU, you're gonna wanna look for settings that are um, high CPU usage. So I'm just gonna go through here. This is GPU, this is medium. So you might consider turning this down a little bit like this. And then you see here, okay, that's low. I'm gonna keep that fine. This is high, so you turn that down as low as possible. Your low, low, high. So I'm gonna turn that down. Turn that down, I'll turn that all the way if you want. And then just keep going through these. Now this may not make a huge difference, but this may make a difference of between like one and five degrees, which could be enough to make your, you know, temperature go from like 95 to 90. And then if you do the other tip that I had at the beginning of this video, you might be sitting between 70 and 80, kind of like I am. So if this video helped, please give it a like, thumbs up, leave a comment, and I'll see you guys in the next one.